found some action figures, G.I. Joe's, a Smurf. Uh, we found garden holes before. I don't know how that gets down there. Around Easter time, we get the eggs, a lot of eggs down the toilet. Objects such as these are also frequently flushed down toilets. Once they are flushed, they head down the sewer system and reach the treatment plant where the water has to be screened to remove these materials. So what materials can go down the drains of our toilets? Although we have a state-of-the-art facility to clean and treat the wastewater, only toilet paper and waste will not damage the system. Wipes cause the greatest problems because even if the package is flushable, the wipes do not have enough time to break down in the sewage system, which can clog the pipes. Ultimately, we would like to prevent these issues altogether. We're fortunate enough to have a capable staff on hand to ensure that everything runs smoothly. Our wastewater treatment operators go through some rigorous training and certification tests to become properly trained in their jobs so that they can operate and maintain the treatment plant and systems to the highest level possible. The plant treats about 400,000 gallons of water per day. To ensure the water is safe, the public works staff administers regular tests verifying that the water meets specific standards at the state and federal level. Upon meeting these standards, the water is placed into a holding pond and then will either be pumped into a field or flow to a rapid infiltration basin where it replenishes the ground. If we do our part to avoid unusual objects from entering the system, the staff can focus on maintaining the plant rather than clearing clogs from sewer drains. Because of the staff's hard work, our water is purified, making it safe for us and the environment.